Uh, also, you got to keep you up to date. It's been a good week for betting. So let's finish strong. It's Friday's best bets of the day with Joey P and Joe Arico because Welsh is on vacation. Remember, go to Bet365. Use the promo code leading off when you sign up. Please go support our sponsor, Bet5 Bucks. Get 150 in bonus bets when you register at Bet365. 18 or over in Kentucky. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER or 1-800-BETS-OFF in Iowa. Terms and conditions do apply. All right, Joe, we got to stay hot here. It's a good day yesterday. Going to go to Minnesota on the money line, minus 135 against San Francisco. Joe Ryan on the mound. I want a good statement start from Joe Ryan here heading into the break. And then I'm going to attack the Schwellenbach. Ah, the Schwelly balls. Uh, he is on the mound today for the Braves. San Diego's at home. Give me the money line. I know it's against the Braves. It sounds wacky, but I don't like the Schwellenbach. I don't think he's any good, and I'm going to go attack him and plus money, plus 112. And then Aaron Judge against the Orioles. Need I say more? If you're not betting this week against the Orioles with Aaron Judge, I don't know what you're doing with your life. He murders the Orioles in his career. Just, just flat out murders them. I'm going over on the RBI, 0.5 at minus 112. And to hit a home run, plus 200. You're getting two to one on that, bad boy. That tells you what Vegas thinks about his career against the Orioles. So you're going to make money. Usually those numbers are like 350 and up, two to one to hit a home run. That's kind of absurd, but I think Aaron Judge can do it. Joe Arico, what do you have for the people for Friday's best bets of the day? We had a pretty good day on Thursday, even though the Dodgers pulled some tomfoolery with Landon Knack and they used an opener in front of him. He still hit the mm-hmm. over um, and we hit the Paul Skeens over, but the Dodgers money line did not come through. But two for three on the leading off debut. We'll take it. Today, we're looking at strikeouts, we're looking at overs for Taj Bradley, Freddie Peralta and Kyle Harrison. So Taj Bradley over five and a half strikeouts. We're talking about a guy with a 30 percent strikeout rate who has a five and a half strikeout line at plus money. I know Cleveland doesn't strike out a lot. But Bradley is really one of the better strikeout pitchers in all of baseball. It's hard to pass that up at plus money. Freddie Peralta at six and a half. He's getting the Nationals. This one also feels very doable. And also the fact that it is plus money. You know, he's a volume guy. If he's able to get to six innings, I think this one is is essentially a lock. Um, Six and a half for Peralta is also, I don't want to say it's disrespectful because it's probably a fair line. But I think he pretty easily goes over that if we do see him go six. And I think that should happen uh, in a spot here against the Nationals. And then... Going to the West Coast, Kyle Harrison. This one was looking at the uh, prop bet cheat sheet over at Betting Pros. Kyle Harrison projected for five and a half strikeouts, and he's only set at three and a half here on the line. It's a little bit juiced. It's minus 145, um, but three and a half really does feel doable there. And all these, of course, at Bet365. Use that code leading off. Hey, Joe. There you go, baby. Yeah, we got a good A at the end there, too, from the <laughs> Canadian. Again, go download the Betting Pros app. Start betting smarter, not harder. Those are the best bets of the day for Major League Baseball from us here at Leading Off. And subscribe to Fantasy Pros MLB. 